Hey everyone, welcome back. In this Selenium Python tutorial, we are going to learn how to locate elements using by class. So we have already seen all of these locator strategies and how you can identify the elements by ID name, XPath, link text, partial link text, tag name, class name, and CSS selector, right? Now I have also explained about find element and find elements, right? So these were the two private methods. So if you want to find multiple elements, you can use find elements if you are using single element so we have covered find element by now there is another class which is basically the by class in python and by with by using by class you can use these private methods so the, these methods find elements so what you can do is so till now we have been doing like driver dot find element by id or by name now with this find element, what we can do is we can say driver dot find element and then there is a by class that we need to import. So this is the usage that, that you can see. And then we can say dot find element and by and we specify whatever attributes we want to specify. So ID, XPath, link text, similar to what we have been doing here till now, we can do exactly same thing by this particular class and this method. Okay, so let's understand how you can achieve it. So let's go to PyCharm and I'll copy all of this code and create a new file. I'll say demo by class. I'll paste everything here. So now I'll use the same page. Okay. And let me get rid of this. Okay. So say for, for example, here we were using find element by class name, right? Now, if we use the by class, so let me go to the documentation. If we use the by class, we simply have to, what we have to do is we have to simply import the by class. Okay. So we'll paste that line here. So we'll say sel from selenium web driver common dot by import this particular class. Okay. And then we can use driver dot find element and then by and whatever attributes we want to specify so these are the attributes that are available for the by class okay so id x path so all the attributes or locator strategies that we have seen here are all available in this by class as well okay so we can simply instead of doing this statement what we can do is we can simply say driver dot find element okay now we can use find element and we can say by right dot and you can see all the attributes that i can use so if i want to use id or name or link text whatever i can simply use them okay so say for example let's use the class name as we have used here okay and then if we go to the usage here so it says by whatever attribute you want to specify then comma separated and specify the locator relevant to that particular attribute so for example you are using class name then you provide the class name as the locator if you are using xpath then provide xpath as the locator okay so here what i'll do is i'll simply say comma and in the quotes i will provide the class name right so this is the class name which i'll provide here and then say for example i'm again sending the keys so I can say send keys and I can send the keys there. So I can say rcv at rcvacademy.com. All right. So that's how we'll be using the by class and find element method to identify the web elements by using any of the attributes that we have seen before. So ID or class name or XPath, we can use anything here. Instead of class name, we can use ID or name. Okay. So if I run this now, it should work exactly the same way as we have seen the other examples. So it's opening the browser. It will find the web element and it will type in the value that we have provided here and closed the browser, right? Now, say for example, I want to use the ID. So I can simply change it to by dot ID and provide the ID of that box here. Okay, text box. So what's the ID? Let's go and check the ID. We'll open selector sub and ID is login input, right? So I'll copy this to PyCharm and provide the ID, okay? And run it, it will give us exact same result. So it has typed in and it will close after four seconds. All right, so this is basically how you will use the by class. So you have to basically first thing is import the by class and then use the find element and by with dot any attribute that you want to specify out of the eight and provide the locator 
and use it exactly the same way as we have used the others right so here we have used the method which is the full name by that particular locator but here we are saying find element and then by class whether id or xpath we are providing with the by class all right so that's all about the locating by the by class in selenium and using the find element which is the private method okay so i hope this was helpful you can try with all the other locators here as a practice exercise and make yourself more comfortable with these locators so that's all for this tutorial i hope it was helpful thank you very much for watching